today is my favorite day he made it a special day so i love tomorrow yesterday but today is my favorite day how are you i hope you're okay i am okay too it's a teacher annunciator welcome to easy limo learning simplified we have done multiplication using the pictures and today we want to do multiplication as repeated addition our question is what is multiplication what is to multiply multiplication simply means to increase to multiply is to increase in number so we are asking our question how many times look at our pictures today we have our counters arranged in threes threes and the second row is threes again so we continue and you're saying how many times someone is asking me teacher what do you mean by how many times i mean how many times does three appear how many times does three appear and that is the same way our counters are how many times does this three appear so we are saying there is row number one that is the first three there is row number two that is the second three and there is row number three that is the third three so how many times does three appear three appears three times three appears three times okay and then we are asking ourselves if three appears three times what is the sum we talked about the sign for multiplication and we said sign for multiplication that is how it looks like what about this sign who can remind us this sign we talked about this one is means to add then we talked about this one we said this one means to subtract so this is the sign for multiplication so we are saying what is the sum so we said multiplication is to increase in number so when you talk about what is the sum you are saying 3 add to 3 and add to 3 sum means add sum means add so let us count our counters and see what is the sum we have one let's count together yes johnny i'm seeing you two we continue three four five six seven eight nine so the sum is nine the sum is nine wow so who can try the second one who can try the second one yes janet teacher the second one says four plus four plus four so we are looking at our counters and we're asking the same same question how many times the question is how many times how many times and how many times does it appear janet how many times does it appear we are saying four appears let's see the first row the second row and the third row so each row represents number four the second row represents this four and the third row represents these four so we're asking ourselves how many times does four appear how many times does four appear so we are saying let's count one two three we can also count using the numbers one two three so we are saying four appears three times four appears three times we're saying four not three four appears three times so we are saying it appears three times then we come and ask ourselves what is the sum what's the sum janet we go so we are going to count all the counters in our question so we have one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve so what is the sum the sum is 12 and that is now our answer multiplication as repeated addition now i want oscar to try and do this one oscar try this one out we have two plus two plus two plus two 
plus 2. Oscar, try this one out. So we're asking ourselves, how many times does 2 appear? How many times does 2 appear? Teacher, can you use another method? Provided it is addition, multiplication as repeated addition. Do you remember when we are adding by, by putting the big number in the head? Yes, you can still add the doubles first. If I add this and this, I'll still get an answer, which is 4. Then I add this and this, so we have 2, 3, 4. I still get a 4. Then I add to the last one. Then add the doubles first. But you see this one now looks like a long method. So we have 4 in the head and 4 fingers out. So we have 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 8, then I add the remaining 2, which will give me 8 in the head, 2 fingers out. 8, 9, 10. And you get your answer as 10. Is that okay? Teacher, that's the method I used very good. So you remember the way we did addition using repeated, using adding doubles, and you can also add by counting on. Now, for your homework today, I want people to try out this one. For your homework today, I want people to try out this one and give me an answer. First thing in the morning, this is what I'm going to check. This is what I'm going to check. That is the first thing in the morning. And up to there, I hope there is nobody who still struggles with multiplication. Nobody is still struggling with multiplication as repeated addition. Just remember, multiply is to increase. So your answer should always be add on it, add on it. So we are adding three on what you already have, three to another three. Then what you get, you also add on the next three. And that is basically what multiplication is any question up to there any problem teacher are we going to, to the field after you've finished my homework copy your homework first in the books then you can go out for field how are you i hope nobody still struggles with multiplication any question it was nice having you around and i hope i'll see you in the next lesson thank you